Assemble. introduced. He goes, just call me an idiot with a microphone. Please welcome to the stage, CJ! Hello. Well, everyone wave at the camera. Wave at the camera. Everyone over here, give us a big wave to the camera. There we go. That's what we like. Hello, I'm CJ! I am not going to lie. I am so excited to be on this stage. I saw this stage for Star Wars Celebration. And I was like, give me that stage. And I fought and they let me come out to see you guys. Are we excited for the Cosplay Masquerade? <laughs> Are we excited for the big WCS Championships? <laughs> I cannot wait to see what is going to happen today. I've seen all of the cosplays back there and honestly, I feel sorry for the crowd judges. I really do. Now, a bit of admin. I want to go through a few things with you. So. The masquerade is going to be uh, judged by some of our lovely cosplayers. Now, when I read out these credentials, it's amazing. So, we have not one, 
but three world champions. And a European champion. I know, it's amazing. The 2023 crown champion of cosplay, Steph of Nerds Gone Mild from the USA. We also have the world champions from WCS Team UK 2023, Supo and Clues. And finally, judge them to, uh, help them to judge, we have the WCS qualifier, oh, sorry, no, the Jaeger Project. And unfortunately, one of our judges couldn't make it because they're not very well, and I think they're watching on the live stream, so everyone shout, hi, Delia! Hi, Delia! There we go, I don't know if you can hear that, but we're all cheering. You know, I'm gonna, I talk way too much, so guess what, should I shut up? That's when you're gonna go, no, we love your voice, CJ. Oh my god, I'm too old for this. Oh, someone shouted, I love you. Thanks, Mum. <laughs> right, so, this is my favourite bit. We'll get to see the cosplays. <laughs> now, we start off with the juniors. Now, these aren't being judged because we all know they would win. So, we have three junior entrants today. My microphone's disappearing from us. Our first junior entrance is KJ, is Kalkrakai Miku from Vocaloid. a challenge. I want every single person that comes out here, I want you to pretend they're your BFF. I want you screaming, I want you cheering, I want you to deafen me. Do you think you can do that? Woo! Let's try that one more time. Can we do that? Woo! Much better. All right, let's welcome our next junior entrant. We have Robin is Imu Atori from Project Sakai. is Ash is Akutagwa from Bungo Stray Dogs. for our junior entrance, how amazing the confidence. And now we begin the masquerade. Our first entrance is Quirky Cosplays as the Queen of Hearts from Alice in Wonderland. I'm a bit of a Baldur's Gate 3 addict. Woo! Any of our Baldur's Gate 3 addicts? Who plays till 3 in the morning when it should be getting up at 6? Ah, uh, 
mind is not my heart. We have Re Lion as Shadowheart from Baldur's Gate 3. Hello, MCM. Oh, that sounded much more debonair in my head. How often, how often have you heard that during the game? No, just me? Wow. I must be the only Shadowheart fan. Right, next, we have Isaac as Orphan of Kos from Bloodborne. tonight. Thank you for that, Isaac. Uh, next, we have KK Cosplay as Queen Amidala from Star Wars Phantom Menace. Swap Five Nights at Freddy's? Anyone know that before? <laughs> From Security Breach Ruin, Mia is Gold Freddy. Say hi tonight. Now, what do you mean, no? Shut the fuck Any critical role fans in the house? <laughs> Who's going to the panel tomorrow? <laughs> I might see you there. As Jesta Laveau, we have Ophelia. Next, Sotty Cosplays is Hangy Zoe from Attack on Titan. <laughs> Something because I found it so funny. Attack on Titan? <laughs> Guess where the Attack on Titan fans are? Right at the back there. Uh, let's try this one. Chainsaw Man? <laughs> there at the front. We have Mick Swordsman is Chainsaw Devil.
you want to hear a really bad pun? I bet it was really sore putting that on this morning. You're welcome. What do you mean, get out? We'll put an end the masquerade. Right, next, we have Venti Smalls is Howl Pendragon from Howl's Moving Castle. We have Candescent as Asmodeus from Hell of a Boss. borrow that outfit for the masquerade tomorrow. <laughs> that is amazing. I, took, I will. I'll do it. Right. Oh, are there any Final Fantasy 16 fans in the house? I absolutely adore that game. We have Lucy as Jill Warwick. I know this will get a big cheer. Any Mario fans in the house? We have Siberia as the one and only Princess Peach. Now, there was a certain song that came out this summer about Princess Peach, but can you guys sing it? Should we have a shot? Are you ready? Three, two, one, go! <laughs> oh, we can do better. I want this one more time. He's ready on three. Everyone, the lyrics are peaches, 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 peaches. Can we do that? Uh, actually, you know what? I'm going off script here, they're going to tell me off, but this is going to happen. Mario, Luigi, Yoshi, stand up! I want your best rendition of Peaches. One, two, three, go! Peaches, 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 Peaches! <laughs> Next, we have Catherine Brown Costumes as Cinderella from Cinderella 2015. <laughs> shouting from the crowd. I can't see. <laughs> uh, we have Double Black as Zai Lian Hu Chen from Heaven's Officials Blessing.
here with me now. Oh. We really need to work on this, guys. It's been a long day. Right, next we have Leah as the meme from Genshin Impact. Zelda fans in the house? Woo! Our next cosplayers using the Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. They're going to be King Raru and this is Sodan Creations. Now, I apologize if I say this one wrong, okay? So you're gonna have to tell me if I'm right. We have Frosted Briar is the Loot V Britannia from Code Geass. Have I said that right? No? We've all done it. Now, if I went, da -da 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 -da, da -da 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 -da, what is that? X Men. X Men. From X Men, Verne Verne is Storm. what they did there. <laughs> Next we have Jay as Porcelain Looks from League of Legends. Next, we have Aurelia Frost as Madoka from Madoka Magica. when people are just so happy to be on stage, it's like, yes, I did it! I love it. I'm an idiot, I know. Next, we have CJ Didham's cosplays is Catherine Howard from Six, the musical. Critical 
Critical Role? But just checking your awake, we have X as Molly Mo from Critical Role. <laughs> Now, sometimes I get little intros, and this one's quite cool. It says, the story of a man, a woman, and the corpses of a thousand evil men. Killjoy cosplay is Helen, when it's three cheers for sweet revenge by my chemical romance. <laughs> Next, we have the Cosplay Amorca as Sam Porter from Death Stranding. I'm not gonna lie, the finger guns got me there. Love it. Right, next we have back tack cosplay is Emmett Selch from Final Fantasy XIV. Someone's right in the front, they go, That's you! Who's it? <laughs> I'm going off script again, Skirt. <laughs> Who said that? Yeah, you good? Stand up, give everyone a wave. Give everyone a wave. A big Final Fantasy XIV fan. There we go. <laughs> They're so going to kill me later. Right, next. We have Pan Fried Girl is Jean D'Arc Alta from Fate Grand Order. Next, we have Kali is Harrowhawk Namogesimus from the Locked Tomb series. Genshin Impact? There it is. 
We have Echo Chamber cosplay is Aoife and Lumi from Genshin Impact. Are there any Frozen fans in here? <laughs> Seriously, it was out years ago. Let it go. <laughs> oh, all right, chill out. I haven't finished yet. Uh, we have CM Cosplays as Queen Anna from Frozen. Now, I'm not going to say these two words again, I'm just going to name the campaign, The Legend of Vox Machina. Astra and Trinity is Vexaria and Percy de Rubo. I'm not coming out in the crowd again just because you're shouting out. That's a sneaky smooch as well. I smooched in front of over a thousand people. Nice. <laughs> oh my god, what am I doing? Right, next we have Battle Damaged All Might as All Might from My Hero Academia. <laughs> Now, I love this, I've got another intro. She's the princess of all of hell. MJ is Princess Charlie from Husband Hotel. I'm meant to be totally unbiased, but I'm sorry, I'm going to totally fanboy over this. From How to Train Your Dragon, The Hidden World. Let me finish! From How to Train Your Dragon, shut up! From How to Train Your Dragon, The Hidden World. Ruxefi in Acorn Cosplay is Toothless in Light Fury. I love the fact that a little bit of prop kind of fell off and they're kicking it backstage, like. Get up, boy. I love it. Right, next we have Shizen Kensi as the Warrior of Light from Final Fantasy XIV.
Thank you very much. Next, Windsor is Pretty Rabbit Miku from Good Smile. From which oh, hat video. at the air? I'm not going to lie, I was reading my notes and I just looked and then saw them do that like, whoa, what's that? That gave me a fright. Now, Stormles? As a Soka Tano, there it is, we have Alex. What did everyone think of the new Ahsoka series? Oh, bit of a mix there. Interesting. Now, I'm going to say this, which will get a cheer. Mario. As Princess Waluigi, we have Patches cosplaying. I want us all to shout the biggest wah just because I want to see how it sounds on the stage. One, two, three. Wah! It sounded as funny as I thought. <laughs> Next, we have Robbie as Hawks from My Hero Academia. <laughs> And our final entrant for the masquerade, um, they haven't given us a cosplay name, they've just put Totoro, because they are Totoro from my neighbour, Totoro. <laughs> Maybe later. Right, now, oh, I'm getting too old for this. I think we need to give a big round of applause for all of our masquerade entrants. They've been absolutely amazing. So that 
that brings us to the end of the masquerade. Our judges are just heading off to start to deliberate and we will announce the winners later on. And now we move to our next bit. Now we're going to watch a little bit of a video because our judges, two of our judges, were selected here all the way back in MCM 2019. And this summer, Super and Clued finally got to represent the UK and compete in the World Cosplay Summit Finals in Japan. And the Blubbin won it! Do you want to see how they did it? Let's take a look on the screens above. World Cosplay Summit 2023 Team United Kingdom Hi, I'm Super, Agent Super And I'm Dr. Clued Dr. Clued, do you expect me to talk? No, 001, I expect you to represent the UK at the World Cosplay Summit Hey, that's you too Yes, enjoy the show as Hakamu Ren, Clued as Chuba, from Maggie, the Labyrinth of Magic. Ready, action! watching it there. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome your world champions to the stage! Go on right in the front and give us a bow, go on. One more time, let's hear it! Honestly, that is truly amazing, well done. And I'm loving the outfits today as well, very nice. Now, I want to ask you, what was it like First of all, competing in Japan, and what was it like when you actually found out you won? Uh, so it was physically one of the hardest things I think I've ever done. We didn't sleep for about six months in the run-up. Um, it's really hot out in Nagoya, so when it was all done, it was the most amazing feeling. Winning aside, just doing the thing feels so good. <laughs> Always do the thing. What about for you? Yeah, I mean, it was just incredible. The feeling of being there, doing what we love, and achieving what we wanted to achieve, which is incredible. 
so. Now, obviously you've got a hard job helping judge the entrants that are coming through. Are there any certain things that you're looking for? Because you'll have experience of seeing the competition across in Japan. So what are you looking for to help the UK win it once again? So WCS is really stage focused, so a lot of it is about how your costumes make an impact on stage, how well you can move in them, and how engaging your performance is. Ultimately, it's about kind of wowing the crowd a little bit. So I think we're looking for costumes that are both really clean and really accurate, but also something that lets people move and express themselves in character on stage, and a performance with some fun bits. Awesome. What about you? Yeah, just echoing what Ruth said, it's 50-50 costume and performance, so we will really be looking out for those amazing performances. Now, before I let you run back to your chairs, is there any final advice to give to anyone who's thinking of competing, even in the masquerade or on big championships like this? Is there any advice you'd give now that you're more experienced in it? Yeah, I mean, I think just do it is kind of the main one. Ultimately, there's no such thing as bad experience. Um, even if you're really unsure about it, just give it a try. You may be surprised. Um, yeah, honestly, just give it a whirl, do your best, and work hard, and good things happen. Awesome. And any for you? Yeah, just do it. I mean, you spent all your time working on this cosplay, slaving away. You might as well show it off to everyone who's watching, and yeah, make, make yourself proud. Well, I think we're very proud of you for winning it. And am I right in thinking this is the first time the UK has also won it? Is that right? I think so, yeah. Now, they're just about to head back to their seats so we can begin. Uh, let's hear it one more time for our awesome champions. <laughs> So, before we begin, let's take a look at the 2024 trailer for WCS. Amazing does that look? Now, the winners of this competition will win a trip to Nagoya, Japan in summer 2024 and represent the UK in the World Championships final. No pressure at all. Yeah, it's amazing. Now, I believe we are ready to begin. So, our first entrants are called Team Artifix. We have Female gunner Mizutsune armor and female hunter Rathalos armor from the Monster Hunter series. <laughs>
I don't know if anyone saw that they just backwards crawled off the stage. <laughs> that is something else. Let's hear it for Team Arty Phoenix one more time. I wasn't sure what to expect there, but that was quite funny. I like that. Has anyone else got a bit of a rumbly tumbly as well? Yeah, I'm getting a bit hungry. Oh, right. Uh, I do believe we are ready for the next one. So, we have Sparky and Ceres as Iamon Thorf and Joser and Apophis from Great Priest Imhotep, the manga. We're not ready. Random prop guy went, we're not ready. So, right, okay, I'm gonna come out and bug people. How are we doing? How are you doing, Mario? Oh, oh, wait there, I'm gonna bug. Did anyone see on MCM social media the person that covered me in bubbles last year? Stand up a second. The stand up, I'm gonna embarrass you now. Yeah, get up, come here. This little munchkin covered me in bubbles, bubbles last time and I'm not happy about it. Right, yeah. I've just been given the tap to say with the go ahead. I may have forgot about that bit. My bad. Right, let's try again. We have Sparky and Ceres as Iam and Thorf, Joser and Apophis from Great Priest Imhotep Manga. Greetings, pesky morsels. I am Apophis, god of chaos, darkness, and snakes. What was that? Anyway, you have all been invited to celebrate that I have successfully taken over the body of this pharaoh. No, seriously, what is that noise? It's so distracting. It's a fly! Oh yeah, sure, that checks. Anyway, with this body, I have the power I need to plunge the world into darkness. So rejoice, humans. Celebrate your imminent demise. <laughs> oh. Let Pharaoh Joseph go. He's my friend. Who? Imhotep, you are a fly. And how did you find me anyway? You're in the biggest pyramid in Egypt. Oh, yeah. I guess I am. Free the Pharaoh. Huh. What's one pathetic priest going to do against a god? My chair! Sorry? I'm gonna send you to the Shadow Realm! Loth, Loth, respond to your priest, please. Great priest, Imhotep. Is this really all you've got? I thought you wanted to save your Pharaoh friend. I do, I will, I just... I might need some help. Apophis is your friend, isn't he? You need to save your friend before I can save mine. I'll need your body, little one. I see you've been causing some trouble. So? Is that really you? Body! You know this isn't right. You need to release this body. You're siding with the human? Idiot! I'm on your side. It doesn't feel like it. You don't belong here. What are you doing? Thought no! I'm sending you back! Let me out! It's dark in here! You're the god of the dark, for God's sake! You but still! Take some time to rest, my friend. No one can disturb you now. There, that's my side of this dealt with. Reclaim your body, great priest Imhotep. Thank you, Lord Thoth. Im? Joseph! <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, let's have it one more time for Sparkle and Saris. Honestly, I'm just blown away with each one after each time. It's amazing the amount of work everybody's went into just to put on these shows for you. Um, also, I think we need to have a big round of applause for our stage crew as well, help them sort this out as well. Hard <laughs> oh, let them up. Is everyone having a good weekend so far? Yeah? 
Who's coming back tomorrow? Oh, I've been told it's Phil's birthday today. Come here, come here. Very quick, very quick, come here, Phil. It's birthday, boy. You know what to sing? One, two, three. He's left now, it doesn't matter. Happy birthday to you. Hey! We do like to embarrass them, you know, but it's amazing. Oh, there's a lot of sets rocking for this. Now, who's going to join us for the Masquerade of Variety Show tomorrow? Not many. Who's going to see Critical Rumble? Who's not going to bother? Wow! That got a lot of cheers. Now, we're just getting the final preparations going there. Oh, Phil's back. Say hi, Phil! Birthday boy! We'll get him some cake later, eh? Shall we get him some cake? He's not having any of my birthday cake, that's mine. Yeah. Oh, I'll tell you when my birthday is, don't worry. Now, I believe I'm gonna get a tap. There's the tap, ladies and gentlemen. Are we ready for our next contestants? We have Huwani and Jazzy Chan as Raz and Kai from Valkyria Chronicles 4. Thanks until backup arrives. Are you nuts? Claude, we can't do this on our own. Please, I need you to trust me. Whatever you say, man. No, don't. It's gonna be okay, Kai. We got this. Besides, don't you remember? What? what? Don't jam now! Come on! Rats, get back! One more shot! Baby. Thank you very much, Huani and Jazzy Chan. The return of random prop guys. We love random prop guys. Now this is where I have to come out and book you again while we wait for everyone to get sorted. Do you know, you know what it is? I'm going to pretend I've got friends. Should we try and do an absolutely massive selfie with everybody on the crowd? Yeah? I'm going to hide in this corner so I don't get in the way. Right, here we go. I'm going to do a set. Let's see if I can get everybody in. Are you ready? I'll do eight every side. So, 
first, are you ready? Big smiles! The middle! The four sides! Should we do a video and I want lots of noise? Are you ready? So we're going to do this as a video, okay? Ooh, it's in 4K. Right, are you ready? I'm going to start over here and I want a Mexican wave going along. Are you ready? Three, two, one! Oh, we can do that. One more time, you ready? Three, two, one! Now I can tell my mum I've got friends. Yay! Where's your money? What money? I'm not paying you guys. Birthday boy's behind me. You ready? There he is. Right. Our final entrant, ladies and gentlemen. Please make a lot of noise for Valora and Dolinix as Veronica and Fafnia from Fire Emblem Heroes. I suppose there's nothing to be done. Wait a minute. That's the ass grand summoning tool. The Brita Blick. And they just left it here on the floor? How careless. Well, it wouldn't hurt if I were to give it a go, would it? To strengthen the Emblem Empire's army. <laughs> I hope I get a rare, powerful five-star hero. Like Rearmed Leaf. I'm Fafnir, King of Nidaviler. I'll show you lazy fools how to truly celebrate the new year. Uh, not another one. The new year is months away. I am Fafnir, King of Nidaviler. You should kneel. I think not. You should know better than to stand against me. You are bound by the hero contract, remember? Now stay. Kneel. Good, good. Much better. Get up now. This way. You're ready to fight for the Endlian Empire. To ever reign. Go, 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 go. Stop. You're going to... Ugh. Why must you be so incompetent? It's no wonder I always lose to Alphon's team when this is what I have to put up with. I'll open the way. Oh, no, no, no. The Order Heroes is coming back. Quick, hide. Alphon's could not know I was here. I'm back. Wait, what happened here? Uh, I, I, I can explain. <laughs> Let's hear it one more time for Valora and Dominix. Now, this is the tough part. The judges are about to go backstage and start to pick their winners. Now, very soon, I will be handed a little slip of paper with the masquerade winners as well. Now, just to explain... Ooh, they left props on the stage. That was silly. I haunt you guys. Get out, okay, right, fine. There we go, I'm going, see you later. No, just to explain how the masquerade prizes work. Every entrance uh, that wins, sorry, every entrance that wins will get a trophy, a ticket to the next MCM, vouchers from Coscraft so they can make a more epic cosplay. Random stage, guys. And Phil. Do we love Phil? A new star's born. Right, we have prizes for best beginner, the two judges award, and then best costume. Ooh. Now, it just says filler. <laughs> I'm gonna go out and bug people. This is the best part. Actually, Mr. Cameraman, do you feel like playing hide and seek? Should we play hide and seek? 
You know how this works. Put the lights down. I'm gonna go hide. No, you're not allowed to follow me. Don't cheat. And I'm gonna go hide. He's watching us from the back there as well. You cheat. Right, this is what I'm gonna do. No, I'm too old for this. I'm too old for this. Right, I hope he's not cheating. Is he cheating? No, right. Find me. <laughs> Has he found me? Oh, no! Whoa! That's not fair! Should we do it one more time? Yeah? I want to steal your... Can I steal Sonic? Sonic's gonna come with me, cause get what? I've gotta go fast. Are you ready? Lights down. Go. <laughs> Find me. <laughs> no! That's not fair! You're too good at this. Okay, this is gonna sound highly inappropriate, but does anyone wanna see my twinkle? Where's my twinkle? <laughs> what did you think it was? What did you think my twinkle was? <laughs> what, what, what? Did you like my twinkle? You did enjoy my That's the worst way you could have phrased that. It's a beautiful twinkle. Size-wise, was it quite a big twinkle or...? <laughs> No. It could be a bit bright. You've been speaking to my partner. Right! Who am I going to pick on? I feel like picking on someone. Oh, a staff member. You're doing video. How the photos turned out today? Good? Excellent. Thanks, that was great. How are we doing? Any cosplayers in the house? I love, you know what the thing is, right? Can you get the camera down here? This girl is trying to get her friend embarrassed standing up. So you know what? Horrible friend, stand up. No, you sit down. Horrible friend, you stand up. No, you're the one who... Do not... Oh, I've got the microphone, do not argue. She's trying to point it. Right, both of you stand up. Do you know what Game of Thrones? Turn around, look at the camera. Shame. 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 Now... Who likes to make friends? So, wait. Oh, wait there. That's a, that's a good one. Look to the person to your right. Say hello, new friend. If you've been here before, you know what's coming. Look to the person to your left. We don't like the person to the left. <laughs> Scowl at them. Oh, we're there, we're there, I love this. Come, come here, cameraman, can we get this here? I've got no one to my side! Stand up a second, how awesome is this, by the way? Yeah. I'll be your friend, would you like to hug? There you go, I'll be your friend. There we go, lovely. My, what do you mean, my first friend? <laughs> the people are taking the mickey out of my twinkle and I've seen I've got no friends. Security? Oh my god, I've just spotted something. I'm sorry, this is happening. I said I was doing it before. Try and keep up, Mr. Cameraman. I've just spotted something in the side of the stage. It's gonna happen. I'm gonna hug him. <laughs> Who's jealous? I made it happen. I'm so happy. My leg is killing me. <laughs> I very stupidly got a tattoo two days before con. Can you see it? I'd have to take my pants off. Right. Who screamed at me taking off my pants? You asked for this. Two seconds. I'm wearing planet boxer shorts. That's not happening. But I will, you know what, this might hurt. Do you want me to try and show you my tattoo? It's very geeky. Okay, let's try this. If I'm in pain tomorrow, I'm blaming all the yous. Now, it's a bit sore. Do you want me to move back, cameraman? It is all of the Sonic. 
Round of applause there, there we go. So, now the pants, yeah? Do we have any suitable music for that tech desk? Oh, this is so painful. There we go, do we have any suitable music so I can... The bell first? That's not happening. It's not happening. I might take the waistcoat off. Funny thing is, someone said, next Comic Con, can you put on as many waistcoats as you can? So what I'm going to do, MCM Birmingham, I'm going to bring all 30 of my waistcoats. I have 30. And I'm going to try all of them on. Let's see if I can do it. Now, do I need to talk to me? Don't focus on me. Go look at the crowd. Everyone give the camera a wave. Mr. Cameraman, get on the crowd. There we go. <laughs> well, I said no. You know, I'll go tell them off. Okay, and then we're going to announce, I'm going to come, no, this cameraman embarrassed me twice with hide and seek. Now, the worst part is, he can't actually put him in front of the camera. So, I'm going to take a photo of you and show security. <laughs> and, hey there. There, there. there you go. I'm going to hold this up to the camera now, so you can see that. <laughs> put, put on that camera. Look at that there. Right. Uh, see how you like it, Mr. Cameraman. Shall we announce some masquerade winners? Now, it's not very often I get to do this, so I'm pretty honoured to get the announced winners. It's usually the judges, but they're having a really tough time deliberating on the... Oh, I'm too old. Deliberating on the WCS winners. So, we are going to start with Best Beginner. Okay, can we have some feet standing? I thought that was going to be louder, I'm going to be honest. Okay, our best beginner is Backtrack Cosplay as Emma Sells from Final Fantasy XIV! Now, this is that really awkward bit where they've got to do the really slow walk from over there, then go through the fire exit, then up the ramp, and when they do that, I'm meant to start talking rubbish to fill time, which is what I'm doing right now. How clever was that? Now, any second now, our best beginner shall walk out of that door in three, two, one, now. <laughs> Set the stage, team members, you're well to for our best beginner. And you may hide over here. We will sort out your prizes very soon. Well done. Now, our first judges award. Ooh. I've just looked at what it is. It is Rex Lee in Acorn cosplay as Toothless and Light Fury from How to Train Your Dragon. Now, Mr. Cameraman, I don't know if you can point to them walking over there. They're just making their way, making their way downtown, walking fast. I know, oh, I can hear the feet screaming as they're trying to get there. This is amazing. What's next? Oh, oh right. Now, I'm going to announce this next one to give them some time to get up. The second judge's award goes to Totoro as Totoro from My Name of Totoro. And as they waddle along, our first judge award winners should probably be appearing any second. Let's hear it one more time. <laughs> Set the stage, take a bow. Lap it up. One more time, please. <laughs> and please just grab a little stand here. There we go. Now this next cosplay I can see taken forever. I wish you could see what I'm about to see. He's nearly there. Should I hug him again? Yeah. Should I hug him on behalf of you? Yeah. Are you ready to make some noise? Three, two, one. Yeah. I'll keep you company, don't worry. You come with me, because I don't want you to walk off the edge. You will be safe right here. One more time, let's make some noise. Can I help you again? 
Don't we do it? Honestly, if you charge a five line, you'd make a fortune getting hooks. Now the big one, are we ready? Best costume. Feet snap. It is Candescent as Asmodeus from Hell of a Boss. Now for those of you that can't remember, this is the one that I want to wear on the masquerade tomorrow. Yeah. They will be up any second. Let's hear it for all of our winners first of all. It was a very tough competition. We had over 40 cosplayers competing. 40. That's amazing. Let's hear it for contestants. Take a bow, please take a bow. Now what I'd like to ask you to do, if you all want to kind of come together, and if you want to take four horses, this is the opportunity. Do you want to just shuffle in a bit? The tour, if you just want to take one more step to the side. There we go. Do you want to squeeze in there? Ladies and gentlemen, your masquerade winners! <laughs> one more time, come on. One more time! Thank you so much guys. What I'll do is I'll let the tour wait just so that we can shuffle down. If you guys want to start leading back down the ramp safely and we will sort out your prizes. You right guys, if you want to start heading down as well, please be careful. Um, you're going nowhere. <laughs> How are you doing? Could you see that? They can see a little bit. Um, well, how was the hug? There's a camera at the top of my head. There's a camera at the top. Oh. Is that a Logitech? That's quite a good brand, that. <laughs> you stole off your husband's work laptop. <laughs> that is, are you a bit hot in there? That, I know, I've got to do it one more time. I'm sorry, this isn't about you anymore, this is about me. I'm going to, I'm going to have the hug. Aww. Let's hear it one more time, thank you so much. <laughs> and as the tutorial slowly walked down the ramp... <laughs> Random prop guy! <laughs> walked right into the wall. Damn you, random prop guy! You had one job. Now, I believe the judges are still judging. Oh, I've just spotted someone. Is the cameraman, can you follow me here a second? Are we good to go? Oh, no, I've got to go talk. I've done something wrong. Boo. I didn't do anything wrong. They're still gonna sack us after the day, let's be fair. I've spotted someone and I'm gonna embarrass him. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, try to contain yourselves. It's Phil! <laughs> Actually, you know what? Screw it. I'm going on stage. Yeah. Get up there, sweet cheeks. Sorry, I said that on my. Ladies and gentlemen, you're Phil! So, how old are you, by the way? I'm 30. <laughs> the big three, oh! Wow, I've got a... Do you, know, do you know how old I am next week? Do you have a guess? 21! 55! <laughs> I'm turning 40. Yeah, the back pain's come then, so you've got 10 years to go. Yeah. So what are you getting for your birthday? Expenses. <laughs> they give you expenses. <laughs> he wishes. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, let's hear all the time for the birthday boy because I think I've embarrassed him enough. <laughs> That's right, actually, does anyone else in here have a birthday? Does any of the birthday boys and girls and people? No? Who has a birthday close by? Oh, 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 oh. I'm coming to you now. If you're going to scream like that, I'm going to embarrass you. You notice I'm not running anymore. I'm knackered. Okay. 
You're going very red there. It's your birthday tomorrow. What are you called? Adam. What's your name? Harper. Great, thanks. So, anyway, everyone shout happy birthday to the Harper in three seconds. Three, two, one. Was that worth it? Can we get, can we, you know what? Stand up a second. Stand up. There we go. Can we, can we get that on camera? There, there we go. Turn over there. Give everyone a wave. We've got the birthday person here. Um, there we go. Are you sufficiently embarrassed? Have you enjoyed embarrassing your friend? Stand up. I'm going to embarrass you. There we go. Oh, this is a nice outfit. What cosplay is this? I'm Queen Bowsette. Queen Bowsette? Wow. Nice. Thank you very much. Right. I think we are nearly ready. Who else can I embarrass? I like him. Oh my god. Is that a giant Sonic? You may realise I am a Sonic fan from the tattoo, which is now bleeding, I think. Oops. Sorry, can I just look at that a second? It's my... Are we ready? It's time! Fine! I've just got a Sonic toy. I'm so close. Are you dressed as like Amy? That is all like the little ears as well. Right, ladies and gentlemen. Good news. It is time for me to shut up. So let's make a lot of noise for our judges to announce the WCS winners. I promised them there. Should I go find them? I think they're hugging tutorial on the back. Oh yeah, it would be very nice to be decent. Please welcome Super Clued. And I'm sorry, I forgot the final one. I'm so bad. And this is why I'm not going to be running around. Come on, you do me the favour. Do it. <laughs> so, Super Clued. Lauren. It's just, just Lauren. I'm just Lauren. I'm just here. And Steve. Okay. Let's go, Mark. Very polished. Here's a good go. You can tell we didn't rehearse this. Yeah, so um, it, it was a very tough decision to make. The, for, for her, all the participants did a great job. You could tell they put a lot of heart and a lot of effort, and they're really passionate about their builds, and we're so glad that they took the time to share this with us today. Yeah, the level of um, like not only crafting but performance uh, amongst the, all of the participants was absolutely phenomenal and it made for a really tough decision, um, but we did make a decision, so yeah. should we know? Alright, so with that, our first place WCS qualifiers for the UK are... Jazzy Chan and Kwani! <laughs> Feel free to come up. I don't know where they're coming from, but they are on their way. Let's make a noise now, come on! Ladies and gentlemen, our WCS 2024 representatives! So ladies and gentlemen, that does bring us to the end of the Masquerade and the WCS competition. Let's hear it one more time for all of our entrants and winners. Thank you so much for joining us today and the best news is we get to do it all again tomorrow. So see you then. Thank you very much. Goodbye.